everybody, welcome back to Tater's Woodshop. Uh, I had a request to make a really simple paper towel holder for a good friend of mine. And actually all he has right now is it's got a top shelf on it and the rollers underneath it. It's got a circle holder, you know, the roller goes through it and really simple holder. Well, let me bring you along here and I'll show you. I guess if you ask any woodworker, uh, when people ask you if you make things, you say yeah and then you over, over make it and you gotta make it out of uh, exotic woods and you know. But anyway, here's my plan. Uh, again, I don't use SketchUp. I just like drawing things out and going with it. So, here's what the side profile is gonna look like. Uh, I have approximate sizes. Uh, it's around 13 inches wide because the paper towel uh, is uh, around 6 inches thick and around 11 inches wide. So there's also going to be the top is going to have a, the top would be a shelf and then another shelf in the middle, one at the bottom, and the paper towel holder. As you see, yes, I have a square. Uh, I have something in mind I'm going to do for this. I haven't seen it done, but I'm going to go with uh, at least what I think I can make and see what it looks like, and it should look pretty cool. So let's get started. All right, so uh, I wanted to show you the layout here. I have the back, which is right around 12 or 12 and a quarter inches. Still don't know the sizes of these things yet. Uh, the two shelves, the top shelf is a little bit bigger, at least what I'm thinking. And uh, the two side pieces. Uh, also, the middle rod that goes through, uh, like I said before, it's going to be square. And that's going to be uh, some maple, ambrosia maple. So it'll have a little two-tone color to it. It's going to be pretty cool. And I'm going to get ready and skip playing all these on the new Grizzly 20 inch planer. As you've seen in the last video, this thing is a beast. This thing is awesome. If you're looking at buying a planer, get that one. But here we go. Okay, well, I got everything cut now, and 
what I'm finding is a paper towel is 11 inches wide exactly. So what I'm going to do to make sure there's room between and have a little space to move this in and out and also roll it, the space I'm going to make between the inside measurement is 11 and 5 sixteenths and then these were half inch rabbits here so it's going to give me 12 and 5 sixteenths width for my back panel and then my total height for the back panel is 17 and 5 eighths so I'm going to get everything ready over here and since we have a nice crisp edge on the back side I am going to cut this and give me a nice 90 and then get all my widths and heights right here at the miter saw so here's how we do it Okay, um, as you can see, I got it together here, just a dry fit. Everything's looking really nice. And as you can also see, my idea, anyway, instead of having a round cylinder that normally paper towels right in, I want to do something different. And the look is going to be a square uh, rod if you will and then the friction of that fitting in here uh, it will still turn but there'll be a little there'll be a little pull to it you know it just won't roll off of there and um, at least that's the design also it's going to be a little bigger on this side so when it's in it will sit flush this side of course will stick out a little bit and I have a, an idea for a cap. To Okay, well, I have the square, yes, square rod <laughs> going through the side. Here's the end. And I have this set where I'm going to go over to my um, mortiser and take out the blue area and make a key that's just going to fit in from the top to hold that. So here's how we do it. Okay, well, I got everything sanded, and now we are going to go for a glue-up. So, I'll keep you from that since we've seen glue-ups from here to eternity. So, uh, be back with you in one second. Alright everybody, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed that build. Um, if you paid attention, you can actually get all the measurements that I gave you in the video and build this yourself if you want. Uh, it's just a little project. Someone asked me to build a paper towel holder for them. Um, actually, what they have is just the top shelf. It was probably only 
maybe five inches wide and it was just the little part that came down that held a round cylinder really simple but of course as woodworkers we like to overcomplicate things and uh, try to make them look nice but anyway um, I'll show you a couple up close things here hope you can see this but um, it does have a square uh, holder through the side like we talked about before it's got three shelves and I like this because it's got some friction to it and it's just not going to roll off and all the paper towel end up on the floor. So, um, but it's got the key on the side. I think it was a pretty cool design. It was fun. Uh, again, not having a design, just going with something. That's the way I like to do things. But uh, I hope you enjoyed the build. And uh, stay tuned because I have another giveaway coming very soon. Please let everyone know about my channel. I really do appreciate your time and uh, thanks for watching.